celebrations at the Colorado party headquarters. Horacio Cartes, who only became a politician four years ago, is now the president of Paraguay. I don't have the words to describe the way I feel, because now we have change. The president-elect vowed to deliver on his campaign promises. The great country of Paraguay is waiting for us and all Paraguayans are working together. From now on I just want to be a tool for all Paraguayans. I am at your service. Thank you. Long live the Republic of Paraguay. Long live the Republic. This victory means the return of the Colorado Party to power. A party that ruled Paraguay for 61 years and that supported Alfredo Stroessner, the military dictator, for 35 years. The 56-year-old tobacco millionaire, who's been in jail for fraud, has managed to convince voters that his business experience will be enough to lead the South American country. 67% of Paraguayans went to the polls on Sunday, with thousands of young people voting for the first time, like Alicia Amarillo. I am confused, but I voted because I think we need change. Nearly 40% of Paraguayans live in poverty and the economy is plagued by corruption. The next president has to make the most of these last five years of economic bonanza. Changes are much needed in education and health. But for now, many Paraguayans are celebrating what they call the new face of the Colorado Party. Mariana Sanchez Al Jazeera, Asunción, Paraguay.